starting craft. Um, I have to be honest, I'm not the greatest at the art and craft exercises, but we're gonna give it a go. So I'm just about to open my little package and inside should be some um, non-stop gel stuff. So you know you get like sticky socks, that's stuff they use to put on these socks and some funky leggings for all under 12 pounds. Um, so I'm gonna basically make my own sticky leggings, which I'm really excited about. Um, so I thought I'd just do a little video for you, but let's go and open this box and see what you will need. So here's my little Amazon package. Um, I'm just gonna grab some scissors and we're gonna go and open. So here we go. I do love Amazon Prime. So these are the pair of leggings. How cool are they? So they've got all the speckled different colours, which are really funky. And the main colour is like navy black sort of colour. So they're really cool. And then this is the sock stop um, stuff I was trying to explain. Um, this is a 100ml um, product. And as you can see, this is what they use for... Oh yeah, sorry, by the way, I've just missing a nail. It's fine. Um, this is stuff they use on the bottom of like non-slip socks and stuff. So I've bought myself some of this too. Um, they do do different colours of this, but obviously I've got the black one. Um, it looks more like grey, but this is the black one. Um, but I think they do grey, white um, and probably navy. Um, but there, I've just got the black one. So... Let's list out the things you will need. So obviously we've got our pair of leggings, our sock stop. We've got a pair of scissors just in case because I had to open the box with, but you never know when you need a pair of scissors. Um, then I've got some masking tape. Um, I've decided to pick masking tape just because it's not very sticky. Um, so it will stick onto the breeches quite nicely and make sure we don't mess it all up. <laughs> so here's the masking tape. Um, I've also got a pen to line out where we're going to put the marks and whatever we're going to do gel or uh, dots and whatever. Um, then we've got a ruler to make sure it's all nice and straight. Um, and then we've got a big bit of paper to protect um, wherever you're going to do it. So on our dining room table, I don't think my mum would be too happy if I ruined that. <laughs> anyway, so this is the next item. We've got just some normal plain A4 paper. Um, so that is to go inside of the breeches because <clears throat> I did... <laughs> she's really winding me up now. Um, I did do another pair of breeches of, by myself and I did mess it up a little bit because I didn't put paper inside of the leg so then it went through to the front. My mum did do one side right but I did Get a sticky front and yeah. a sticky back. So it wasn't too great but we've got some paper so that doesn't happen this time. So that is all you will need for these make your own sticky breeches, well funky breeches. Um, so let's get cracking. Okay, so I've just laid the breeches um, uh, face face way, way down? Face, face down. Face down. <laughs> so I've got the back of the breeches here, the bum part. Um, I'm just going to decide what pattern I'm going to have. So you might want a rounded pattern and how you want the gel parts to align um, and then we're going to measure so it's equal each side because we don't want it to look odd and how far down we're going to have the dots so this my mum's just drawn a lovely picture i mean this is artist at your finest it's better wouldn't it even go as high as that you could do it so it's no you can have it more no, like no, here like that. yeah i agree i think more sort of here because you're not going to have you need gel stuff up here. So I'd do it from more your seat to like around that. here. So this is what we have come up with. We're gonna have a more rounded look, but not go right up. So there's the waistband, and then we're gonna come down an inch and then start it there. Um, now mother has got a plate. It's probably a bit too big, isn't it? So I want it to be further down like there. 
Yeah. That's a good idea to see the shape. Thank you for the use of your lovely plate. So then we're going to do dots. Last time I did like little squares, um, but it didn't really work as well. So today we're gonna try little dots. Um, so yeah, we're gonna measure out now and get started. Now what I'm gonna do is go edge to edge with the masking tape. So we know that we're gonna put dots either side of the masking tape. Do you agree, Lil? Yeah. Stuff we can go between those lines and know that we're going the right direction. Direction and <laughs> it's even. Is that about even there, Lil? Right, so your next most important thing to do is to cut out some pieces to chuck down the legs. Because, as Lily has explained, if you don't, and then you put the sticky stuff on, it goes through and then your leggings will stick together. You won't be able to get your legs in. Comes out, I'm just gonna do a test on here. As you can see. piece and as you can see once the masking tape's gone you can hardly even see where we put the dots so any little errors and any bits that have smudged which a few have all gone into one big so my mum has just finally finished the um sock stop stuff um i wasn't brave enough to do it this time because i really messed it up last time don't get it on your um jumper. yeah i don't want to get my jumper either <laughs> um but my mum has just finally finished there is some that have joined up but I think my mum has mentioned the funkier the pattern, the less likely you are to see it. Um, so it doesn't really matter. Um, and also for £12, how cool is that? Um, and we can do more peasant. More peasant leggings. <laughs> We've got an extra little dot there. Oh my God. Um, we can do some extra pairs of leggings <laughs> for the 12 pounds too. Or we could have done until we spilt yeah, it over. Yeah, until I spilt it over the leggings slightly. Um, but hey ho. Um, so we've got to leave these now until the morning because it's about five o'clock in the evening. So we're gonna leave those until tomorrow morning and then I will try them on and show you the final result, which I'm super excited about um, because as you said, it's... Um, ah. That's why we have paper, guys. Well, until you came along and chucked the bottle. I'll leave these until tomorrow morning and then I'll show you the final result. Leggings on a budget. So I've just come down to the yard um, to film this review of my breeches and um, I see that someone has decided to have some time in the tack room and started chewing my bridle and pouring it. He's been in here, taking out my boot bag, open the door. <laughs> oh my God. What have you done as well, Snippet? Have you been helping? Is that right? Do you want, should we pick this up? Should we pick it up? Get off then. Hey guys. So we have the little reveal of these beautiful leggings. Um, they are very out there with the pattern, but that's exactly what I wanted. But we have sticky breeches, as you can see. So, so cool. Um, I'm just going to test them out by riding Perry. Um, so I'll let you know how that goes. And yeah, we'll see how sticky 
they really are. Um, I thought about putting the links to the products I used in the description, so the um, stop, stop, stop stuff. Um, but send me pictures if you try out your own leggings um, and send them over to my Instagram. I'd love to see them. Um, but yeah, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys next week with a brand new video. Bye!